morning guys it is monday the 28th of september it is peak week day three so if you guys haven't seen already i uploaded a vlog where i showed you guys like the depletion phase the peak week so that was saturday and sunday where my carbs were super low cardio was super high and i wasn't training so today is the first day whoop, almost tripped and died today is the first day where my carbs are getting like progressively bumped up as the week goes by and today's also the first day that i check in with paul every single day so this morning i weighed in at 49.4 kilos um yesterday was a new low for me yesterday was 49.3 so essentially just the same weight i feel super flat depleted really so i'll insert some photos of this morning's check-in right here i'm just walking to donut time i only have one shift there this week i booked off all of peak week just to have more time to do other things so yeah once i get to donut time i will be sending paul my check-in as usual once he gets back to me i'll keep you guys in the loop i'm not gonna vlog like everything i eat every day of peak week because that is a lot of vlogging and I can't always, always film everything I do and eat. But I will be showing you guys like my staple meals and also all of my training. So this morning I prepped a fuckload of seitan. Like I prepped 10 servings of it so I have enough until Saturday. So I did that this morning. I'll put the recipe in the description for you guys as well. And with the seitan, I'll either have it by itself or I'll pair it with popcorn or I also have this like very low calorie like pasta that's made out of oat fiber and cognac flour really interesting it's like nine calories per hundred grams so i'll pair that with those or with uh cauliflower rice that is store-bought because i'm too lazy to make my own cauliflower rice so yeah seitan is definitely my main source of protein in general so that is a staple meal and i'll be showing you guys all my other staple meals throughout the week and yeah, so I will catch you guys later, either when Paul replies to me or when I train. Today's my last full leg day before the show, so I'm gonna push pretty hard. And yeah, I'm excited, I'm feeling good. Energy is not too low, sleep is shit. I woke up at 4 a.m. this morning, but yeah. Guys, less than one week left and I can devour like all of these. I'm at work and I want to have my oats, but they're cold, so I'm literally gonna put them on the freaking heater just to heat them up. That's how desperate I am to like get warm. Really sad. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow them stuff for you. Too nice to y'all. Now I gotta up price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Frozen. A6 all the hay. I won't get involved today. Got lost in the ball and age. I'm flipping the bars. I'm flipping the, flipping the, flipping the. All record, off record. I still count wins when they got it. On record, off record. I let them take advantage. I was wildin'. On record, off record deals. Tell them talk to column for the quote. On record, off record. I still want the act, not the ghost. Running through it with the young and blooming. Said that less impressions. I'm succumbing to it. I've been giving yeses when I shouldn't do it. I complete the check with the loser, loser. And I'm barely moving, but I'm still gon' boost them. I can't work on winners when I know you're losing. So I work the winners and they throw the Guess I have to pivot, shooting the bazookas for the facts. I need racks, paper, rack, rack, cash, fuck a tax. That's a joke. Tell them laugh. Uncle Sam, fuck out the bag. Brody plot, we'll get a whack. Contract, give me the max. I got lab on my back. You ain't that, then it's raps. Whoa, 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 whoa. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. Right. For the record, you ain't trying to grow, then it's done for you. Alright guys, so still Monday, 
um, I just got home from the gym. I never get home this late from the gym. It's 7.20. I did legs and cardio. So that was my last leg workout before show day because we don't want to like obviously hold any water in my legs. So yeah, this is the last leg workout. And it was a really good workout despite these three consecutive days of my carbs not being high and like cardio still being quite relatively high. Like I feel pretty good. So Paul um, got back to me. He said that we're on track. Everything's perfect. Exactly what we want to see. So no changes to the plan. So so I'm happy as well. I need to do all my client check-ins. So with my client check-ins, I record a video response to their like check-in on my phone and I upload it to YouTube as like a private link. So I do like video responses. So I'm gonna do those now. I've got like eight to do, but it is a very like personable way to kind of, you know, get back to my clients. So yeah, if you're interested in online coaching, I do have a few spaces left, especially after my competition. I'll have a lot more time to take on more clients. So if you're interested, I do full training plans, nutrition plans, um, demo videos, things like that so just shoot me a dm on my instagram it's just at other lips or you can leave a comment down below as well and yeah i'm just gonna record these and then eat because i really need to get back to my clients asap because it's quite late so yeah hey how's it going sorry this is a bit late i just got home um from work so you smash it this week i'm really happy that you're enjoying the new workouts Alright guys, so I'm happy four days out. It is Tuesday today. I'm just getting ready to go see Chen Yang. I'm gonna shoot some like content because in her new apartment building, they have like their own little gym. Obviously it's not like state-of-the-art equipment, but it is nice and quiet to like take some content stuff. So I'm just getting ready to go there and I checked in with my coach this morning. I really didn't want to check in. Like I did not want to. I don't know why. Like I just was not happy with my check-in at all this morning. Um, um, my weight went up like almost a pound which isn't that much considering i did train legs pretty heavy yesterday and like usually when you train legs like your legs can retain a lot of water um but i think i don't know i think the scale is just getting to my head i also have not slept properly in a couple days like i keep waking up at 3 30 in the morning which is really annoying so i've been weighing myself like really early too yeah so i don't know and my digestion is like shit like it's so so bad which sucks so yeah i just told coach everything i was like look like i don't feel very good my digestion feels a bit shit and i'm annoyed that my weight went up despite like my carbs aren't, aren't that high still like i only had 110 grams of carbs yesterday and um like 45 minutes of cardio and stuff so i don't know we'll see we'll see i don't know if i'm gonna vlog all day today i'm gonna try and vlog my workout try and film it the gym has been getting like a lot busier recently which is annoying because like when i film people are, are all in the way but i will do my best to try and get some more training footage for you guys and like maybe a couple of meals here and there so yeah i will catch you guys later so i am in the habitat of chen yang and Haini. hello i'm constipated tmi so <laughs> Haini made me this what's in it so it's uh Okay, so awesome. I will keep you guys updated if I shit. <laughs> I feel like YouTube fans. These are like, these are all outfit and shit. <laughs> Literally. You guys take tequila, we take fucking glutamine. I'm also gonna make it a shit. Lol. I'm here with my good friend Alex. Hello. So he was asking me like, what cafe do you wanna go to? And I was like, I only get tea with some stevia. So it doesn't really matter, yeah. I got prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims that's all but my run through the money the pressure be calling left on my blessings I feel like I'm falling the birdie is back tell me I'm garbage I'm going through something that's why I ain't calling phone in progression it's all that I wanted the phone in affection I summon and dub it cause bitch I got prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims on prelims that's all but my run through the money the pressure be calling left on my blessings I feel like I'm falling the birdie is back tell me I'm garbage I'm going through something that's why I ain't calling
calling. Phone and progression. It's all that I wanted. A full win affection. I summon and dub it. Why you be all in my line about nothing? Why won't you go get you a dollar or something? Don't hang with a nigga who lying for nothing. I see that we different. You riding, I dub them. I don't do discussions on bragging about hundreds. Don't go to your places. I know that they sunken. Don't call me your brother. I barely could trust it. I talk to a shorty. She bagging the bugging. And I'ma need all of my dollars on corporate. So hand me the money. I divvy the pie. I'ma give all of my people a portion to build them a fortune. I'm flipping the ride. I can't be mixy when iffy the vibe. And 40 on 50 is really the time. Why is you all on my phone like you want me? Like you wasn't pushing the kid to the side. I don't know if you bitches are thinking I'm blind. Cross on my crosses and dot on my eyes. Done with your efforts, I'm dealing with pressures. I know it's a lesson, that's word of the wise. Dubbing the mixes, I'm mixing. I know I've been missing. I needed some personal time. Fuck all the pictures, dimensions. I don't with your digits. I mean it, I'm staying inside. Cause bitch, bitch I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money. The pressure be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression. It's all that I wanted. The phone and affection. I summon and dub it. Cause bitch, I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money. The pressure be calling. Left on my blessings. I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression. Alright, guys. So I just got home. It's been a long ass day. It's like, what time is it? It's like 8 p.m. almost. I still have my last meal to have. So today was last to back and bicep workout before um, I started doing like pump workouts and everything. So yeah, I messaged, well, I checked in with coach this morning. I said to him, look, like I'm not feeling my best. The whole like no sleeping shebang. And am I like, I didn't know what to expect. I asked him, are we gonna expect my weight to go up or go down this week? Um, Like, because we are increasing food, decreasing cardio. He said, you know, we're expecting the weight to come down just wait get some better sleep let the magic happen so i was like okay let's trust this he hasn't made any changes he just said just keep it going you know stick to the plan so we're gonna do that but yeah today's been like a pretty i just feel kind of shit honestly whenever like my digestion isn't great i just feel kind of shit all right guys so happy wednesday or not so happy wednesday i didn't exactly have the best start to my day so yeah yesterday like obviously coach said you know we do want to see the scale go down i was like all right cool he was like trust the process i was like cool and then this morning i woke up heavier again i was 50.1 kilos which isn't like heavy at all but it's just like i'm so far off of my lowest weigh-in my lowest weigh-in was 49.3 that was on sunday and my carbs haven't even been bumped up that high yet and like i don't know and but the thing is like i'm not sleeping well my digestion is still crap i'm not feeling great i think i'm just really stressed out yeah and then when i took pictures this morning i was like like, oh, I don't look as good as the weekend. Like I was getting really, really just like in my head and I really need to get out of my head because it's not good. But yeah, I told coach everything. I sent him my check and I was like, look, I feel like shit. I was comparing my pictures from today to the weekend and it made me like just really upset and I'm really worried because like things aren't going as planned and like what's happening. So we'll see what Paul says. But in other news, I got my new pair of heels, right? I don't know if you guys can see yeah right here so i got like a platform and rhinestones because i don't know like these are my old ones that i've been using for the past like few months obviously to post and i just don't like them like they're not high enough and there's no platform and there's no like rhinestones so i got an upgrade they're like just really hard to walk in because i'm not used to how high this heel is and obviously there's like a platform and everything so i'm just like wearing them at home right now but yeah i've just been chilling i actually well i didn't assemble this my Michael assembly for me, let me show you guys. I have a desk in my room now. I can work and I have like drawers on the side. So I've just been doing work all morning, guys. I'm like so, so busy these days. It's currently 12 p.m. I've been up since like five in the morning and I've just been doing so much work. I've been doing so much reading for university. I'm doing like a lot of like accounting and finance stuff, which like is really fucking up my brain because it's like a lot of new things that I've never done before. I am writing so many new client plans. I have so much to edit because I'm uploading every day this week. Uh, yeah, so I've just been really busy. And what's annoying as well is that like, I'm just really hungry. Like on my low days on Saturday and Sunday, like I wasn't very hungry. I was a lot of energy, but I think like my metabolism is so adaptive. Like lower calories, cool. Okay, I'm not hungry. Once I start bumping up the calories like we're doing throughout the week this week, like today I'm on 140 grams of carbs. Like, 
my body is like give me more give me more like there's no point in being ready if it's not the day of the show so it's wednesday it's not saturday it's fine if i'm not ready today i just need to be ready on saturday so I'm gonna keep that in mind i'm gonna have a pre-workout meal now i'm gonna have um some seitan and potatoes i prepped so much potatoes because i'm gonna have potatoes today tomorrow friday because they're the, like the best most satiating carb source and i digest them really well like they're a simple carb source they digest super duper easily so I'm gonna have my meal now keep on doing some work hey guys so as you can maybe tell it's dark it's the evening I did not vlog much today because today has been I mean now I'm okay but earlier like I was just you know like when you're stressed out so you stress out because you're stressed out and it like and it's just like a never-ending cycle of just stressing yourself out that's where I was at yeah so basically my digestion has been a bit weird coach got back to me I will insert a clip of what he said hey Aliyah you know Looking at the pictures, uh, I thought you looked better today than you did yesterday. Um, you're telling me you feel watery, um, but you're also telling me that your sleep is terrible. And those two things are very much correlated. We need to get you a good night's sleep. Your stress is high. And, you know, we're not going to make any adjustments to the plan right now because at this point, it would do us no good to have you come into the show super flat. You know, the bikini division is not about stringy, flat physiques you need to have filled out muscles and you're very lean so i know the number on the scale is messing with your head but you're looking better as the days go by and you're also telling me that you're not able to get a pump um so our carbs are still too low and our stress is still too high so i don't know if it's possible but maybe today you could try taking a nap um you know taking a cold shower before bed you know cooling the body off typically helps you fall asleep um, you know, maybe watching a movie or a TV show that distracts you from competing. Sometimes the anxiety of getting on stage can actually cause it, but we're, we're not going to adjust the plan just yet. I want to have another day of recovery. Um, you know, go through your routine. Just remember like all the months of hard work that you put into this show can't be undone by a day or two of stress. So you're probably creating more stress than you need to just thinking about the fact that you're stressed right so the most important thing is that we just continue the plan and uh, if we need to adjust something we will uh, but it won't be today today i want you to follow it exactly as is i want the carbs to go up the cardio to come down and uh, as you said you usually respond better after refeeds and we're getting closer to those numbers so we're gonna we're gonna keep it going and uh, hopefully you sleep a little better tonight okay i mean if you have any questions but trust me you're on track you're on point and you will look way better saturday than you do today if we just follow the plan. All right, thanks, Aaliyah. So that like really reassured me. I was doing cardio when I was watching his response and I was like, thank fuck, because that's reassuring. I essentially swapped out my nighttime oats for two slices of bread with some almond butter, just because he said to maybe bring down the fiber a little bit as well. Um, just because like sometimes when you eat foods that are lower in fiber, they digest a lot quicker and easier. So things like white bread, white rice. So I did that. It was actually really good. I used this almond butter by Pip and Nut. It's like the gingerbread limited edition one it is so freaking good and then i put some of the banoffee zero calorie um syrup on there as well i didn't film my workout today because i was kind of in a rush so i trained and then i had to go get waxed down there uh, i'm not gonna go into detail about that and then i had a consultation and i'm back in my flat and i feel pretty good i'm just gonna you know trust the process like get out of my head because it's not doing me any good so i'm gonna try and really just chill tonight go to bed early it's literally 8 p.m i'm gonna just chill in bed now like with a book thursday friday i'm gonna do full days of eating and then I'll do a separate vlog for show day as well. So I'll show you guys everything I eat on Thursday, Friday and the way I train because my training is changing a little bit. So yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Sorry if I've been like a bit of a negative Nelly. It'd be like that sometimes on prep. But yeah, I want to show you guys like all the ups and downs and everything. So thank you guys so, so much for all your support. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye!